Howdy. Feel, feel that little stutter in my van there? You see it? The little shake? Oh yeah. That's what's going on with my van. That's where there's something's wrong. And I'm, uh, I'm about to uh, go and actually do... Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm at the heart of what, where the problem... I mean, I'm, I'm going to die... I don't know what I'm saying. I'm at the heart today of what I'm supposed to check with getting the van fixed. Hey man, feel that thing shake? I mean, yeah, you feel it, right? You see it. I feel it. I'm going to get... Okay, here's the deal. I'm actually... I'm finally going to check what, what the manual... I got the actual Honda Odyssey service manual for this vehicle and it told me what I should check and I'm actually doing one of those things right now. I'm going to go, I'm going to do what the manual says and I'm going to hopefully fix this thing because it's driving me nuts. And here's the point. I'm hoping of course it'll fix it but uh, you know we, we try everything but what what the manual tells us to try. Then then we last resort, okay yeah I'll give that a shot. You know what I'm talking about. The manual for life. Here's one of the half, here's half the manual. We find, you know, we try everything but what God tells us we should do. Everything else kind of somehow or another seems like it's, you know, that'll work. That'll work, you know. My marriage got big problems. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'll try, you know, let's see what the counselor guy says. Let's go, let's go look at a magazine. Let's, I don't know, you know, let's talk to our friends. Let's not see what the Bible has to say about it. Let's, uh, oh, what else could be a problem in life? You know, there's plenty of them, of course. And you know what I'm talking about, because you're doing the same thing, I bet. Let's try this self-help thingy. Let's wear this kind of something, you know, bracelet thing that, you know, it'll relieve tension. You know, boy, the, you know, there's snake charmers all over the world. They're, they're looking to take your money. Because I know there's a lot of religious people that are like that, too, and that's one of the reasons why you're not looking to the book. You're letting those kind of things stand in the way of what you know is true. Well, then there's, there's another problem, too. You know, there's the wrong book. You get, you get a, you know, you get the wrong word. You get the bad seed. That ain't going to do you any good. Because the devil's got that one all monkeyed up. I'm talking about anything other than God's actual true word. I told a fella yesterday, I got real bold. I know some of you are thinking crazy, but nope. I was talking to my buddy Wax Leaptoe, and he was saying, you know, he, he appreciates this kind of boldness. And uh, bless the Lord, I think, you know, that's one of the reasons why I, I did this. But I, I asked a fellow yesterday, I give him a testament. I give him one of these kind. I say, hey, can I give you a testament? He goes, yep. He goes, boy, a lot of people, he goes, there must be something going on. He goes, you know, a lot of people give me a Bible lately. I go, really? I go, who else give you one? I go, what do you look like? He said, well, I was at a fair this past, this past summer. And he goes, and they give me one there. And I said, okay, well, listen. And I go, well, I said, that, that's because the Lord's coming back. First I said that, and he goes, ain't coming back soon enough as far as I'm concerned. And I said, that's right, that's right. I said, but listen, I go in the back of that one you got, in the back of that testament. I mean, I, I didn't force this one. I was walking away, and then the Lord kind of nudged me to do something. I mean, I went back and I said, I said, hey, listen. I go, look in the back of that little testament you got there. I said, and if it says, there's a, there's a, it's got John 3, 16. I said, if it says believes, it doesn't say believeth, you throw that one out. If it says believes, because uh, that means it's an NKJV. And I said, don't, listen, don't worry about what I said. Just, I said, you, you hold on to this one. I said, if you don't feel right about chucking that other one out, you know, track me down, I go, they, you know, I used to put my name in those testaments, you know, as, as who it's from. I said, track me down. I says, give it back to me. I'll throw it out for you. So that's some bad seed, I'll tell you. And if you're wondering what in the world I'm talking about, you know, because I'm not going to expound upon this anymore, feel free to message me on the YouTube messaging system, and I'll, I'll tell you what uh, the details of what I'm talking about. Or look at some of my other videos. 
Mm. You know what I'm talking about. All right. So I'm where I gotta go. I'm at the junkyard here. So bless the Lord. Thanks for watching. Let's see if we can hit the button on this thing. There. Let me show you the junkyard since I can't figure out how to turn this thing on. There. There it is. Oh, isn't it a glorious place? That's where they have one 1999 Honda Odyssey right in this place. Just one. And all those nice, lovely vehicles back.